Hi everyone, thanks for watching. Okay, so for those of you who know me, you know that I used to own a very busy cafe in Glasgow and uh, one of the more popular sandwiches I used to do was the Aikman's Club Sandwich. Um, so I thought that was the perfect video to do today. Um, I actually don't know anybody that doesn't like sandwiches, so um, I hope you like this one. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to make the sauce for the sandwich. Um, I'm making a, a roast garlic mayonnaise. Um, so what you're going to need is you're going to need half a bulb of garlic. And just cut that, cut that in the middle. Um, I'm going to put it on some tin foil and just drizzle it with a little bit of olive oil. What we're going to do is we're going to roast this in the oven for about 20 minutes. I know this looks like a lot of garlic, but actually. Um, um, when you roast garlic, it actually becomes quite mellow and sweet. Okay, so I've got some uh, baby jam lettuce here, which I've just washed. So I'm just going to shred that up. And we'll just stick that in a bowl. And we'll keep that to the side. I've also got a vine tomato, so we'll just slice that. Try and slice it quite thinly if you can. Okay, so I've got a chicken breast here which I've just kind of opened up. Um, I'm just going to put some cling film on top of it and I'm just going to uh, flatten it out with a rolling pin. I'm now just going to season it up. A little bit of olive oil. And that's ready just to go in our pan. Okay, so I've also got some back bacon here. Um, I'm going to use three slices of this. This is unsmoked, um, although you can use smoked if you prefer. I'm just going to grill that on a hot grill on both sides. Okay, so our garlic's been in the oven for 20 minutes. Um, it's nice and soft. So I'm just going to let this cool down for a little bit before we take it out of the skin. Okay, so once that's cooled down a little bit, we're just going to remove the bottom. And we're just going to squeeze out the middle. I'm just going to crush this with our knife. Just into a paste, then into a bowl. Okay, that's our garlic. So I know that looks like a lot of garlic, but um, it's actually not too strong because it's been roasted. It's a lot sweeter. Um, so to that, I'm just going to add about one and a half tablespoons of mayonnaise. Just put that to the side. Okay, so I'm just going to stick our bacon under the grill now. Okay, so the next thing we're going to do is get our chicken on. I'm using a cast iron pan for this. Um, so get it nice and hot. You don't have to use a cast iron pan, you can use a frying pan, it's fine. I just like this. I think it gives it a nicer flavour. So, straight on. Okay, so while we're waiting for our bacon to cook and our chicken to cook, uh, we're going to get our bread toasted. Um, I'm using a farmhouse loaf for this. 
Um, but you can use any kind of bed that you like. I'm going to cut it quite thick. I just think um, you cut it a little bit thicker, it holds everything together better. Okay, so we'll get that in our toaster, these slices. Okay, so we'll just flip our chicken over. Okay, so our chicken's cooked, so I'm just going to take that out and put it to the side. And we'll get a pan on for our fried egg. Okay, so our bacon's cooked as well. I've grilled it on both sides until crispy. So I'm just going to put that to the side as well. Okay, so just going to fry our egg now. Um, I'm going to use one large free range egg for this. Okay, so I'm just going to gently flip over our egg. But, uh, don't cook it too much, you want it still soft. Okay, so now that everything's ready, we're going to get everything layered up. So, we'll start off with some some of the garlic mayonnaise in the bottom. And some lettuce. We'll just put, uh, put some tomato on the middle, on the middle layer. Then we'll cut our chicken. On with our bacon. And we'll just top that off with our fried egg. Okay, so now we're just going to put this up, build this up together. Okay, so I'm just going to stick a couple of skewers in this just to help hold it together. Okay, I'm just going to go on with a few vegetable crisps. Okay, so that's the Aikman's Club Sandwich. Okay, so thanks everyone for watching my video today. Uh, please give this a go. Um, if you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Um, and I look forward to seeing you all again soon.